hey guys happy 2019 happy new year i hope 2018 was a good year for you and i hope that 2019 be an even better year for me 2018 wasn't the best but i'm glad to have made it to 2019 and for some of you you've been here with me from the very beginning one whole year you stuck around that means there must be something that you say you know what i can learn from something from her You've been liking my videos, you've been sharing my videos, commenting on my videos, and a special shout out to Liberian Guy. You've been here commenting on every single video I upload. Um, some of you even share my videos on Twitter. I don't have Twitter, but you've been sharing my videos on every platform. Thank you guys so much. Every bit counts to help the channel grow. And thank you for sticking around. Thank you for being here for so long. For those of you who are new, thank you for thank you for being here as well. Make sure you hit that notification bell so that every time I upload a new video, you're notified about it. And let's just say I'm usually not the type of person that makes New Year's resolutions because um, I try to be a better person on a daily basis. But 2019 specifically for this channel, I intend to do better. I haven't been as consistent as I would like to be, but 2019 is the year I want to be more consistent to bring you guys more content at least twice a week. So for our very first 2019 video, I'm going to be making spicy mango chicken. Starting with the chicken, I have 14 pieces of chicken in there. I already seasoned it and I'll just be showing you the kind of seasons I use. I that's the all-purpose seasoning and I'll have all of the measurements on your screen and seasoned salt garlic salt curry powder and coriander I just mixed all of that in with the chicken so I just pan the chicken on a lined sheet pan make sure they're single line so that it's easier for the chicken to get done I put that in the oven on 400 degrees for about 30 minutes. So that's the mango sauce I'm making there. I have two habaneros, half small onion, and one whole garlic clove. Just make sure you puree it fully. I added some water to make the puree easy for me as well. So I add chicken seasoning, about a half teaspoon, and the mango nectar, one cup of mango nectar, that's the brand I'm going with, doesn't matter, you can use any kind you want. I cooked the sauce for about 15 minutes on medium heat, and then I add the man mango nectar. At this point, I add a half teaspoon of garlic salt to season it a little bit better. And now the fresh parsley. And now the chicken is out. I transfer the chicken to a baking dish and spread the mango sauce over it evenly. Today I'm going with cauliflower and I'm adding two tablespoons of olive oil. Half teaspoon of seasoned salt. One tablespoon of curry powder. Quarter teaspoon of country spice. Quarter teaspoon of black pepper. And I just toss them all together. And I roast this in the oven for about 20 minutes on 375 degrees. I'm also going with um, fries as my starch. I decided not to eat rice today for once. <laughs> so I'm just, just regular fries, frozen regular fries from the store. And I'm using my um, deep fryer for this. 
there goes the plate came out looking good and tasting great as well of course this young man would not let me eat my food and he's smelling it smelling the cauliflower acting like he's eating something so bitter but he ate all of my fries from my plate yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching i will see you in my next video don't forget to like share comment on these videos and subscribe see you next time Peace.